Good morning everyone, my name is James Cagle. Today we're creating a video using the packet tracer uh, provided to us from the Cisco Net Academy. Uh, on this packet tracer, which is 8.2.4.3, we are going to be configuring the uh, WEP on a wireless router for security purposes. Um, so basically what we're doing, we'll be going into the router and we'll reconfigure it, we'll give it a new SSID and then we'll give it a key and then we'll go into the customer PC where we'll pretty much do the same thing. We will give it a new SSID and we'll uh, give it WEP on, on the wireless interface. And so let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and click into the router. Alright, we'll go to the GUI tab. Alright, <clears throat> and in here we're going to go to the wireless settings. Okay. And then we're going to change it from the here. We're going to change it to customer wireless. All right. This is ID broadcast. We're going to save the settings. All right. We're going to go in here. We're going to give it security mode of WEP. And at key one, we're going to go 1A to B, 3C, 4D, 5E. Alright, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to save that. Okay, and then we're going to go over here. We're going to go into the customer PC. Alright, and in here, in here we'll go to the config tab, the wireless. Alright, see right here, here's the SSID, Linksys. They need to match. If they don't match, you're not going to get on. Customer wireless. Oh. Uh, okay. And then what do we do on the other one? We gave it the WEP. All right. So now we need to put in the same key because without the same key, they can't recognize each other. So it's 1A, 2B, 3C, 4D, 5E. All right. <coughs> all right. And then from here, what we're going to do, we're just going to go in and check connectivity. All right. What we're going to do, we're going to do an IP config all. See what we got. All right. So we get default gateway is 192.168.2.1. All right. So let's go ahead and ping that. All right. Alright, we can ping that. So let's go ahead and ping the DNS server. Which is right here. Oh, it timed out. Okay. Why is that? What happened? Well, let's figure it out. Oh, okay. Alright, let's go like this. Let's go let's go into the web browser. Let's go uh, H. <laughs> okay, so we missed something along the way. All right. Okay, so let's go back into here. Let's go back to the config. Let's go back to here. Customer wireless. 1A, 2B, 3C, 4D, 5E. It's WEP. Alright. Let's go back into here. 1A, 2B, 3C, 4D, 5E. Okay, wireless. Basic wireless settings, customer wireless, enabled, save settings. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we're able to ping that, all right, which is our default gateway. All right.
I was typing in the wrong. <clears throat> I was doing 192.168.2.10. So there's nothing to really connect to. It was dot one dot ten. That's what I was doing wrong. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and check our results. There we go. So that is how you configure a WEP on a router, wireless router, and a wireless co uh, workstation. You have to make sure that the SSID is readable to both sides, so they both have to be the same, and you got to have the same key. So if this wasn't saying, hey, my security key is 4, and this one is saying my security key is 5, there's no connection. So without the two, you can't get on. All right? Thank you much for watching. You guys have a magnificent day. Bye.